Okay, third cutting. First time on the beach with the Stony Creek. And it looks okay. Right, coming down now. You're right to come down now, Tan. Thanks, mate. Okay, on the beach, real easy, no trouble at all. Yeah, it's behind the Land Cruiser though. Yeah, better than the Colorado at least until I get the uh, heavy duty clutch in. So now 32 kilometers up the beach uh, to zone two. Yeah, that's where I have seen a couple of the good spots mate, is yeah, down the end, there's a nice sort of open area, easy to access for the caravan mate. And if they're taken, we just turn around and we just move back up till we find something. TV set up. Um, even with all this cloud cover, uh, it's still reasonable signal. Uh, relatively easy, little cheap kit like uh, this one here. So just a, you know, uh, 50 bucks for a, a dish and sand, and your Bass Dakota is at 2.99. Um, and uh, you know, coax cable, and your. Uh, You've got your TV sorted out. You'll need a meter though, and not one of those shitty little ones that uh, a central needle. There's a lot of satellites up there, and they all make the needle look up and down. You don't know which one you're on. Uh, you need one that identifies the uh, identifies the satellite that you're looking at. And uh, so, 159 bucks gets you a reasonable meter, and um, yeah, then you're all good. Although, you're on TV, you've got TV wherever you are, and uh, we're on the beach. You see us anyway. Um, and say hi, ask any questions, and uh, you know, I've even got one or two kids with me, so uh, bring your money with you. Yes, bye. Still lots of cars heading up the beach, going up to Double Island Point for their day in the sun. I didn't think there was any point. Uh, considering that uh, the wind gets up and nearly blows everything away, I decided to um, stay dry um, and you know maybe watch some TV and cook some lunch and um, you know, have a nap, maybe a couple of sherbets. Uh, it's all good here in the Scout 15. What can I say? Living the dream. Because it's raining and it's shitty and it's windy and uh, can't be much fun up at Double Island Point standing in the rain. Okay, we just had a visit from the um, Ranger, Queensland uh, Parks and Wildlife. And they've told us um, there's a severe weather warning coming for the next two days. 250 mil of water. Um, it's raining now. It's awful. Uh, tide's high at one o'clock. 
um, he said it's a good idea to get out. So looks like uh, this little trip has come to an early end, but uh, better safe than sorry. Um, it's not going to be fun towing the van up the beach in this weather, but a little bit of experience, eh? Anyway, um, maybe we'll get sunshine next time. You're packing up? Yep. Yep, time to go. So the rangers came and told us to, uh, it's best that we pack up, severe weather warning. A few people um, still uh, going to brave it. Uh, not for us. It's um, time to pack. I don't know they're packing up. Yeah. And uh, it's not quite low tide yet. In fact, it's not low tide until 7 o'clock, so... Um, we're just taking it easy. Can you throw the tracks on in the back of her tyres so I can reverse back?